नमस्कार माय डियर फ्रेंड्स प्रीवियस गवर्नमेंट्स वर नेवर सीरियस अबाउट द अपलिफ्टमेंट ऑफ स्टेटस ऑफ डिफेंस फोर्सेस इन इंडिया आफ्टर 2014 अराइवल ऑफ प्राइम मिनिस्टर Narendra Modi on the scene there is a true <coughs> progress in the upliftment of defense forces Nehru Gandhi family misused defense vessels for their personal use patronizing national security for personal leisure nehru gandhi family exploited indian warships keeping security at stake prioritizing the members of one family the congress party has always kept India's national security at stake for the <coughs> benefits of Nehru clan with each secret exposing a senseless a sensational revelation comes into the limelight as images of former prime minister Rajiv Gandhi and fam- family relishing on Indian warships are making the news. Prime Minister Narendra Modi in a rally in New Delhi two years back stated that Indian Navy's former flagships INS Virat was used by former prime minister Rajiv Gandhi and his in-laws as a personal taxi Modi's statement should have been taken as a fact and an eye-opener example of the betrayal of trustee by the Nehru clan but a downpour of reactions was a witnessed which targeted not the gandhis but the prime minister of india who made this same full fact wide open tearing apart congress claims of sacrifice for the nation using warships for vacations holidays personal comfort the nehru gandhi family exploited national security to the fullest with several of questions mounting on the credibility commander vk jetley spilled some beans of reality he stated that rajiv and Sonia Gandhi used INS Virat for travel to celebrate their holidays at Bangram Island Indian navy resources were used extensively he was a witness and was posted on INS Virat that time it was during the year 1988 that the Gandhi family had stationed the INS Virat off the coast of the Lakshadweep island it is not for the first use of warships for vacations of Nehru Gandhi family that prime minister modi quotes was not limited to just rajiv gandhi misusing for his friends and Italian family the malaise started from the Nehru himself 
Prime Minister Modi was quoted as saying, Congress Namdar family had misused the pride of the country. INS Virat like its personal taxi. They had insulted it. This incident is of that time when Rajiv Gandhi was the Prime Minister of the country and they had gone out on vacation for 10 days. During that time, INS Virat was stationed to guard the maritime boundaries but it was sent to bring the Gandhi family which was going on vacation. After that, INS Virat had stopped at a special island with their entire family. It was there for 10 days. Among those who were holidaying with Rajiv Gandhi were his in-laws. Interestingly, the entry for the people living from the mainland to the Lakshadweep island and vice versa had been stopped. People were barred from entering the place as the then Prime Minister Rajiv Gandhi was busy holidaying with his family and friends. The vacation of the Prime Minister was a pre-planned affair and the preparation for the same used to bring four months prior. Rajya Sabha MP Subramanian Swami also recalled an incident of how Nehru dynasty used its power in a tweet. Swami said, the Namo citing Virat misuse recalls for me the case of my father-in-law J.D. Kapadia ICS who as Defense Secretary in the 1950 refused to give Air Force plane to ferry one of Nehru's European mistresses. Of course, he was transferred and next secretary okayed. Thus, the decline has begun. Windy, vindictive and shameful as it is, Congress has always prioritized the self-interest of its dynasty above the nation. Playing around with the nation, the Namdar Congress signifies no streak of nationalism in their behavior or work demeaning facts and converting up for their malicious acts. They always tried keeping India at a level which sees no progress or development. Even as Congress has laid claim for the credit that is due behind INS Vikram, India's first indigenous aircraft carrier commissioned by Prime Minister Modi, it forgot that Jawaharlal Nehru and Rajiv Gandhi had turned Indian Navy warships into personal taxis. Congress claim on INS Vikrant is spurious. Nehru Rajiv Gandhi used Navy warships aircraft carriers for vacation. As India rallies behind its first wholly indigenous aircraft carrier, INS Vikrant on Friday when it was commissioned by Prime Minister Narendra Modi, a sullen Congress could not just join the people in pride and jubilation. Like a broken record, Congress jumped to lay claim to the credit of INS Vikrant. Sonia Gandhi, loyalist Jairam Ramesh was quick to tweet 
इंडियाज फर्स्ट इंडिजिनस एयरक्राफ्ट कैरियर आई एन एस विक्रांत कमीशंड टूडे इज ए कलेक्टिव एफर्ट्स ऑफ ऑल गवर्नमेंट सिंस नाइनटीन हंड्रेड नाइन्टी नाइन विल प्राइम मिनिस्टर In February 2014, then Defence Minister A K Antony had said that the Congress-led UPA government had no money for to buy Rafale jets. After inaugurating the Defexpo that year, Antony had said that government had no money left and that all major deals would have to wait. That was when the defence forces were. grappling with the shortage of all kinds and using obsolete equipment former prime minister rajiv gandhi used ins virat india's another aircraft carrier of the centaur class 4 personal vacation back in 1987 The tradition of using Indian Navy assets at sea for personal use was started by Rajiv Gandhi's grandfather and Rahul Gandhi's great grandfather Jawaharlal Nehru. He also was the first Prime Minister of India. In June 1950, Nehru was. vacationing on INS Delhi a Leander class light cruiser built for the navy in 1933 it was known as HMS Achilles in the British Raj and had commissioned into the New Zealand division of the Royal Navy in 1937 Jawaharlal Nehru was accompanied by Indira Gandhi young Rajiv and Sanjay vacationing aboard INS Delhi during their voyage to Indonesia in June 1950 the vessel was returning to the Royal Navy at the end of second world war and in 1948 was sold to the Royal Indian Navy to be recommissioned as HMIS Delhi in 1950 she was renamed INS Delhi and remained in service until decommissioned at Bombay on 30 June 1978 thank you for watching this wonderful video please like comment and share the video subscribe the channel namaskar my dear friend thank 